hey I'm back so I am I, I'm trying to get my space together and one of the things I always do is I, I change my um, my carousels my fragrance carousels so um, with me pulling out everything it's time to change them up put away the the more fall winter and just brighten and lighten them up right and I'm looking in my beauty room area. I, I'm debating if I'm going to show y'all me getting rid of stuff, trying to clean up some stuff because I don't know. I feel embarrassed, y'all, because there's a lot going on and I still don't know why I'm putting all this shit. I'm just being honest. But in the meantime, I'm going to show you the carousels. So I've changed the carousels. This is a long because I'm going to show you the things that I've taken out and I'm going to show you the things I'm putting in because I've never really shown the carousels like that. The only thing I've ever done with the carousels is shown them like on TikTok and IG and just spun them around. This time you'll see everything in my thought process on how I do my carousels. So if you would like to see how I change out my carousels from fall and winter to spring and summer, come on and hang out with me. Okay, so here is the carousel, one carousel, and how it looks right now. So I'm going to be removing most of these. Some of them will stay. A lot of them will move. Um, and so we're going to go through each section, remove them. I'm going to start removing them, and then we'll start putting things in. So this section right here is this side. So we have Tuberosa by Nishane and Ani. Now I'm very kind of, I have this like way I like things to be. So on the top, I always put low lying um, uh, fragrances because I don't want them to be too tall. I just they make it things, I think it makes it look a little top heavy and awkward. And then the ones that are like here, I don't want them to be too heavy. Even though they don't really move, I still have this thing about, I don't want to be too heavy because I have this fear of them falling. <laughs> so that is those two that are coming off. Then we have uh, Alien Essence Absolute. Did I wear this here? No, because I didn't go anywhere. Uh, Kaali Vanilla 28. Uh, this is Scandal at Night. I do need to get a bigger bottle of this, but this is Scandal at Night. And this is Moresque Diadema. All right, so those are there. And then on the bottom, I have Manceras. And my Manceras are usually always on the bottom. This is Moonlight in Heaven by Killian. This is not going anywhere, so this is going to stay here. And I'll figure out where I'm arranging it. This is Musky Garden. This is Black Vanilla. And this is Oud Orchid. None of these are getting put away. I use a lot of times I leave my Manceras out, but those will be sitting there because those are um, I wear them all year, especially Musky Guard, Oud Orchid, Black Vanilla. Those are kind of like all year round. Plus, I like having my Manceras out. Y'all know I'm a Mancera ho, so there's that side. All right. Then this side is, this is, oh, these are amouages. This is figment. Now, I actually wear figment in the summertime, so this might stay out. And then we have sunshine. So this is staying out definitely, because I love amouage sunshine. So those are staying out. <laughs> then we have the Ellis's. This is super amber and B. These are definitely gone. And then, of course, this is Kayali Invite Only, Amber 23. And this is definitely going to be put away because that is definitely a fragrance for the winter time. Then we have this, which is, which one is this? Let me open it up. This is Playing with the Devil by Killian. I'm keeping these out. I usually keep a lot of these out. So this is Playing with the Devil. So this stays out. Then we have Floral Street, which is this one is Black Lotus. This is going to be put away. And then this is Yelani Lana Espresso, definitely being put away. This one is, I think this is Voulez-vous Coucher avec moi by Killian. And then this is, of course, Rosé All Day by Gallagher. 
All right, so now next up is this side. This is huh, Rose Ooh by Nikolai. This is Under My Skin by Francesca Bianchi. And this is Kiss Me Intense by Nikolai. So these will all be getting put away for next season. Um, even though I could get away with like probably under my skin because oh, she's so sexy. <clears throat> but I'm going to put it away. Then we have Erin Evening Rose. And I'm conflicted about this one because it is a incense rose, but it's kind of light. So it could actually be like a evening rose. So I'm going to decide about this one because it might be coming back into the rotation. And then we have Decisions, Decisions by Imaginary Authors. This is a kind of, what's in it? It has tuberose and sarsaparilla and raspberry. It's in quite an interesting tuberose. Let me smell it. Mm, it actually could be this year time of year too. So let me put this as that. Then we have Flores Cheapers. This is staying out. But I'm going to take it off for now because it might be moving to a different space. And then this is La Petite Chocolate by, who is this by again? I think this is Nobile 1942. And they have a, a three set of these and they're chocolate based. I do want to get them all. Someone sent me this one. But the, I'm going to put this one away for now. And then this is Good Girl Gone Bad by Killian. Stays out. And then this is uh, Clandestine Clara. By, by Penhaligans definitely gets put away and the Ruthless Countess Dorothea definitely gets put away for the season then let's hit this one right here <laughs> Woo, slow down killer slow down now slow down I guess it's like oh it was heavy see because I was having issues with it moving and it was not swinging right because it was heavy all right, then we got this. This is Amouage Journey. That definitely comes down. And then this is Amouage Inter Interlude Woman. So this comes down. Then we have this. This is Lulu by Casharel. This was given to gifted to me last year for my birthday. This always stays out because she's Lulu. So she has to stay out, right, Lulu? I'm sorry, not by Casharel, by Lulu Guinness. So, yeah, has to keep this one out. This is Vanilla Ascura by Ganache, one of my favorite vanillas. Can't get this anymore. I cherish her, but she's gone because this is a deep, rich, spicy vanilla. Put that away. Then we have Iris Prima by Ben Halligans. This is a classic Iris. This will stay out, but I might put it someplace else. But this is Iris Prima. Ooh, she's so pretty and gorgeous. And then we have Bois Dore, which is a sexy um, vanilla. Everybody's talking about Bois Dore now. Bois Dore is this really um, rich, um, kind of ambery vanilla. It's just really just gorgeous. So I'm gonna put that one away. And then down here we have Woman in Gold. <laughs> My rich lady fragrance always stays out. And then down here we have Wild Cherry, which stays out. Wild Python, of course. And then this is Gold Prestigium, which is one of my favorite Manceras. So that will be staying out. Ooh, what did I miss here? Oh, this is Dancing Roses. So Dancing Roses gets put away too. Even though I have worn it in the uh, summertime and it was fine, but I just prefer her in the fall in the winter time so we're gonna put her away and that's not to say i won't wear my thing but you know i got enough stuff all right so now we have cleared this one out so let's see what we're gonna put in here let me try to figure out what i'm gonna put here so the first thing i know is i'm doing the top and the top is going to be pretty much all amouage because I have a nice little amount of amouage for the spring time. So let's get ready for her spring and summer. So because I got yellow on that side, we're going to put this love mimosa right here. Well, yes, I have a thing about the symmetry. I want it to just look perfectly gorgeous. What else do I have to put in here? Okay, then I have this and I think these will look counterpoint together. Then this is lilac love right here. So we're going to put this one here. 
So let me, let me move this over so I can look at it. So I like them like this right here. Then we're going to put Love Tuberose right here. And Honor right here. There we go right there. Then we're going to swing over here. I thought I had more amouages than this. Oh, I do. I. Oh, okay, I do. Hold on. Okay, next up is Blossom Love right here. And then for symmetry, because you see I got all of them up here. I'm going to put Portrayal because if the ones that I have left, this might be the one that I will wear. Now, I'm trying to see how many I have. I thought I had 11. Hold on. What's going on? So that's eight up here. Then I have nine, ten. I thought I had another one. So I'm only at ten of amouages? Huh. So apparently I miscounted my amouages. I only had ten. Now, y'all know I feel like I need to get another one to get to my list. Ah, okay. I still have a couple more on my list. So stop tripping, Louise. Okay, so the first the other thing I need to do is I like the symmetry of it all. Oh, is this why I don't have them there? Okay, so I need to move these. So I have these right here which is these Manceras, and I am going to move these Manceras over here because I just like to have them across from each other because it just makes symmetrical sense to me. So we're going to do that right here. <laughs> All right, so there we go. We got that done. Now let's figure out where, what else we're going to put on here. So I've got Iris Prima right here. Let's see what could fit. So it's all about the fit and the look when I do this. So I think I'm going to put some fruit here because it fits right here. See, once I start putting stuff in, it doesn't move as well. So I'm going to put some fruit there. And then we're going to put one more. Hmm, can this fit? It's all about the fit. Nope, can't fit. All right. That one won't fit. Mmm. But this one will. So this is La Petite Robe Noir Hippie Chic. Oops, oops. I'm sorry, baby. Now, I really do try to optimize the space as much as possible. So I'm going to put this right there, this right there, this right there, this right here. Because Lulu has to stay out. Maybe I'll put Lulu on a different one where I have a little more space. And then we're going to put another small one right here. So let me find something found something so i'm gonna put the launch or d um edt right there looks good this little row looks nice okay looking fabulous now let's do this side right here have more space for taller ones haha -ha. let's try calcus floor royale back here let me move this and this yep she fits that's calcus floor royale and then we're going to put, because um, <laughs> I need to balance this out and I, and, a, and I like a certain look, but I can't have it too heavy. I mean, there's so many thought processes behind this. Do y'all see this? So we're going to put Alien Goddess. I think she'll look cute right here. Okay, they look cute together. And then I'm going to put the Lulu right here. Give it a little punch of color. There we go. All right, now this is a shorter one, so we need to put some shorter bottles. So let's go with some shorter bottles that I have. Eh, let's see, let's see, let's see. And I, there's a certain size and style I like in these the smaller ones. So is this too short? Okay, so this is my Ormond Jane Osmanthus. Let me go grab the Taif. All right, so now I'm going to put down, I got the two for down there at the bottom. I'm going to put a good girl. Gone bad off fresh behind. Let's put this right here. And then we're going to put Ormond Jane's Taif next to it. So I got my Ormond Jane's together. There we go. And then we'll go put back our woman in gold. Okay, she looks good. She looks good. Now we're here. So I'm move back down my Moonlight in Heaven. So this side is good. Now I got a short stack right here. That's the short stack. Let's come on with the short stacks. Um, give me a second. 
All right, so let's put up some stuff. Now, at first, I wasn't going to be showing these or putting them up, but I'm like, these are mine and I wear them. So this is Ganache's A Cigarette in the Rain. I'm putting that one out because I really like it. And then we have I Am Love by Ganache. And then this is Nag Newell by Maison de Darius. I don't know if I want that behind them, though, because it's a little shorter. She's, it's a little shorter. So I think I might need to move this one to another one. Because I don't like to put the short ones behind. Because I want to be able to see things. And I just don't like it behind. And so I don't think that would work. Oh, let's see. Let's let's put this one. Can we do this? Hold up. Let's see. Can we do this? Then we have Flora Sheepers. These are all about the same height. Okay. And you know, I got my symmetry going. Then can I put the Nog Noodle here? Can the Nog Noodle go right in front? Kind of yes. Kind of yes. Okay. Let me, let me, because I always want to see what's behind shit, because I don't, I, I just had this belief I'm not going to see something if it's totally covered. I know I be tripping, so I'm going to take this one out again. Boy, Nagnul, I can't find a spot for you, but I know what I'm going to put here. I'm going to put my Velvet Flowers by Montal right here because it's light enough that I can see behind it and see that I have something there, so that makes sense to me. So we got the Montal right there. Okay. Next up is this side. Now this is a tall one. So let's put some tall stuff. So I'm gonna put Gardenia by Elizabeth Taylor. Ooh, I don't, nope, I can't, ooh, nope, can't put her, okay, you a little too tall, man. You a little too tall for this world. Can we do this one? This is uh, NYC Premier. Oh, this one's too tall too okay i see what's happening here i see what's happening and it's not working with my symmetry okay how about this one can we do art and beauty well art and beauty fit ha 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 we have found a winner winner chicken dinner so that's art and beauty right there man i was about to get in my feelings like what's going on why can't i find some why am i getting all this noise Okay, let's see if these two fit. This is Mimosa Tanneron by Paris Monte Carlo. Yes. And then this is Arancia di Sicilia by Paris Monte Carlo. You see how I did that? You see how I did that? <laughs> okay, so now, and then we're just going to throw this one in here to give it a little pop of, you know, something different. So there we go. Now this one is the last one, the bottom one. So let's see what we're going to put here. This is a little shorter. So can we put my Nog Noodle here finally? Okay, so we're going to put this Nog Noodle. But we need to put something that is a little bit taller in behind it. Um, This is La Artisan Parfumers. La Artisan uh, Nuit de Tuberose. Let me see what this fits. Might be a little tall. But it is not. Okay, so we got that. So we got that right there. And see, I can still see it. That's my whole criteria, is that I can see everything when I do this, when I spin it around. And then I have this, which is Splendida Bulgari. This is Iris Dior. So let's see, will this fit? Perfect. Okay, now I think I can put something else right here, y'all. I think I could sit something right here. What y'all think? Just something a little something. Do I have something tiny, something low? I don't think so. I think I did everything I could here. Would this fit? Water Lily Sun? Will Water Lily Sun fit? Ah, it's a little crowded. I don't like the crowded feel. All right, so there we go. There is this one here oh she looks pretty doesn't she this looks so pretty for the springtime yes okay okay so now here's the other side of my carousels i have to sit a little bit farther this is kind of a little more awkward you can't i'm not quite as close in but this is the best i could do so you can see everything so we're gonna go by each section and then we're gonna start moving stuff out so this section, this is Janoon, this is Rasasi Janoon Leather. This is definitely not this time of year. It's a deep, heavy, rich, kind of oody leather. Ooh, it's good. Okay, so we put that away. 
Then we're going to get, this is um, Madonna's Truth or Dare Naked. It could actually stay out, but I think I'm going to put it away because I really like it in the fall. Then we have Dahlia Devin. This is the original. Now, I love Dahlia Devin and some are going to be up here, but this is the one that I usually wear in the fall. This is all year round. Now, you can wear this all year. This is a beautiful floral. Then this is Giselle by Carla Frasci. Um, I'm not going to keep it out, but this definitely can be worn this time of year. You see my hand? I tore up my hand. Oh, it looks a mess. I do have 11 amouages. I forgot about interlude. Okay. All is right in the world. <laughs> And now I have on the bottom of this one, I have all Mancera's, but I'm going to take some out because there's some that I definitely probably wouldn't wear this time of year. And, um, and I'll probably put some different Mancera's in. <laughs> so this is Oud Cafe. Definitely. It's not something I wear now. Oud Exclusive. And... Oud Vani. So those are gone. All right, next up is this side. This is my Judith Liebers. This is Topaz. Definitely, definitely putting this one away. Minadir Oud. Oud, this is a beautiful Oud for um, the fall. It's plum and everything. Oud is sexy. Sexy, sexy, y'all. Then we have Marema by Tiziana Terenzi. Um, I've talked about this before. It's um like it's similar to Black Orchid, but so much better. If you don't like Black Orchid because of that funny note, you'll like Marema. This is Grand Soir. This is my only MFK that definitely gets put away for the for the spring. Then down here we have holidays which is definitely staying out and i need to get a new bottle femininity right here and pearl so these are all staying out oops oops don't be moving that fast don't be moving that fast and then we have rasasi's janoon Satin. What happened to all the stuff I had on top? I don't even know what I did with it. This is Rosasi's Janoon Satin. This actually could stay out. It's kind of a fruity floor, but it's a really deep one. So I'm going to put this one away. I have Stash by SJP. Man, my hand looks terrible. You see how... This is what happens when I don't drink enough water. That's why I drink so much water. I wasn't drinking water. Messed up my hands. All right, so we're going to put this SJP Stash away. Let me use my pretty hand on this. No, because it's hard to do this one. <laughs> that looks so crazy, doesn't it? Okay, let me just not let y'all see the thumb. All right, so this is Jasmine Rouge by Tom Ford. Definitely gets put back. And then this is Ombre Vani by Laura Mercier. I'm going to be putting another Laura Mercier out instead. Now, this is Coco Vani. Y'all know this ain't going to wear, and I need to buy a new bottle of that one, too. Um, and then we have Precious Oud right here. That stays out because it's a pretty lightweight oud. I'm going to be doing my ouds for the summertime, and that's one of them. And then we have Jardine Exclusive. All right. Now, next on this side, we have the La Entredies. This is Intense. And this is, of course, Rouge. What's kind of sad about this whole thing is I'm seeing that I still don't have that much space. Jesus. Then this is um, Rose's Vanille. I'm going to keep this out for now. But this is a really deep one. That's better suited for the winter time. I ain't going to lie. Vanille Exclusive. And Amber Fever. This is a beautiful amber for the time this time of year. Ooh, let me smell her. Yeah, this is beautiful this time of year. Because it's a little bit lighter. Okay, so now we have cleared this out. So let me put some Mancera's back in here. So at the bottom of this side, we're going to start here. We're going to put 
juicy flowers right there. Can y'all see where I'm putting this at? I'm trying to get y'all a good look at it. There we go. So we're gonna put juicy flowers back at the bottom. I'm gonna put some pinks down here. We're gonna put roses motherfucking greedy. Hello, baby, it's that time of year for you. And then this one, which is a newer one. I didn't know I had this many pink ones. Okay, but I don't need uh, vanilla out right now, so we good. All right, and so then we're gonna put pink prestigium out. I have Indian Dream, but me and Indian Dream, we have a love-hate relationship. So I'm gonna put, okay, so I'm putting Juicy Flowers in the bottom because it has the white. You see how that worked out? These have the gold and this has the white. You know, I like the symmetry of it. The symmetry of it all. Okay, so now we got some space up here. So we're gonna take some taller ones that I couldn't put over there. So let's put the gardenia because this should fit maybe not oh this don't fit y'all okay this still don't fit okay so you not going you're not gonna be out here honey bunny well i'm pretty sure this one fits so then this is gonna be the fifth avenue new york nyc premiere oh my god these things are so tall do y'all see this these are so tall okay never mind i'm giving up on them <laughs> right now i am giving up on them now, I'm pretty sure this, this will fit, but then it's kind of heavy. But we're going to put the Eric Butterbog Fabulous Magnolia right here. So she fits. Okay. But this one might need to go on the other side because it's a little bit. No, they're the same size. Okay. So then we're going to put that there. And then we're going to put. Hold on. Let me find some. Okay. After careful work, I come up with some. I'm going to put Sage Spell right here. And then I'm going to put, of course, liquid diamonds because we've got to have that symmetry. Okay, so there we go, right there. Whew, I feel so much better about my decision making right now. Whew, that did, huh. Now, on the top, I'm going to put this. I'm going to put the Tuberose Gardenia Private Collection right up here. Do I have space for another one? Ooh, I might have just enough space for a small kind of sleek thing like that. Do I have anything that's small? Oh, I do. And then we're going to try this right here and see, does this work together? No, I'm going to put these together. Maybe not. Okay. Then I'm going to put this Dahlia Devin La Nectar right in front of it. Does that work? Oh, I don't think so. I think it takes up too much space. You cannot see the beauty of the private collection. And that is why I have so many issues because I wanted to have a certain look and beauty about it. And yet still do what I needed to do, which is house my collection. So here we go right there. I think if I find something, we'll go back to that. All right. So now we have these right here. These two. Okay. Let's make this happen, y'all. Let's do these two right here. Let's go with hibiscus palm. Will that fit? No, it does not fit because I got the full size. Okay, so these are gonna fit because I was gonna put them both. But you know what I'm gonna do? I got an idea. <laughs> I got an idea, never mind. I'm good, I'm good. I figured it out already. <laughs> so let's hit right here. Let me have a second. All right, took me a minute to come up with something, so here we go. This is Agent Provocateur's Matrice. We're gonna put that right there. And then we're gonna put Montal's Blue Oud Velvet, because ooh, I love that for the, uh, whatever it's called, the summertime. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. That's what I'm trying to say. All right, so then next up, here we're going to put on this one on the top is this going to work we're going to put your long and gold by McAuliffe so that'll sit right there and then we're going to put now I'm going to put the Givenchy Dahlia Devin the Nectar I think these two will be cute together yep they look good together right there. Yes, baby, yes. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see that, how that looks? Okay, now next up is right here. Now here's what I think I'm gonna wind up putting here. So let's work with me, y'all. I'm ready, I'm moving, cooking with gas. I Cat Jasmine by Erin right there. 
and then we're gonna take the hibiscus palm right here boom and then we're gonna throw in this i know it's a little off of my symmetry but my water lily sun i need a big one of this this would be perfection if i had a big one don't y'all think if it was a big one right there perfection or do i do like this let's see what this look cute we can put water lily sun because you're still gonna see it but then there is my symmetry. Do y'all see how that looks cute together? Do y'all see how that looks good together? All right, and then next up is at the top, right? So let's do something at the top. I got a couple of things I could put at the top because I'm still trying to go with this shape I got going on. And this is Signorina Rybell by Salvatore Ferragamo right there. Now, do I have something else that I could put next to it or in front of it? Why is this cat yelling at me? She must be up to something. I'm a little scared. Hold on. Oh, I do have one. I never even talk about this. This is Fleur de Passion by Fragonard. I forgot I even bought this. I bought this last year. Uh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be discussed in a minute. Okay, look at this one. Okay, now we're at the last one. We only got these two to do right here. Oh, this is about to be good, y'all. I think I got this. I think I got this. So on this one, we are going to put, oh, uh, what did I say might be able to fit in here? Afnan's Rare Tiffany. Can this fit? It does. Oh, look at her. Look at her. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, then we got that. And then what else can we put here? Because we got two spaces right here. We can put some stuff. Let's get some stuff up in here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Let me think. Let me think. Okay, I got this last two for that spot. Watch this. This is going to be, um, this is Angel EDT in the comment. Bam. Do you see how that looks? And then we have raw spirit this is midnight pearl right there so there's midnight pearl gonna put that right there okay so now i've made an executive decision about the top because we you know we talked about the symmetry issue so let's make this symmetrical so i'm gonna move this one the private collection right here and i'm moving it so you see how they're across from each other they look good see how they look good up there like that see that okay and now I'm going to put and see how this looks because I had Dahlia Devin, the nude one, right? It's a little less. It's not quite as okay. You see, okay. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see? Oops. I got y'all looking at other stuff. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see that? Okay. Do y'all see that? Okay. Now, the reason why I did that is because I have this right here that I want to put. So then it will all become clear. This is Judith Lieber's Exotic Coral. So that needs to go right there. O-M-G. This is looking gorgeous, y'all. This is looking gorgeous. Now I need one more kind of flat, similar to these type of shapes. Let me see what I got. Okay, y'all, wait until y'all see this one. Y'all gonna be like, is this one I'm saying? Put me in, coach. Put me in, coach. This is... My newest one, Bronze Goddess Nui by Estee Lauder. Now I'd have both the Bronze Goddess and this, but I just think this is going to just set it off. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see that? OMG. So let's flip, let's do a little. Let's go on and check them out. Let's make sure they look good. Okay, the man series is looking good. Okay, everything looks good. And the spring ones are done. What do y'all think? Ooh, I'm so proud of these. This is this is a good look, both of these. Y'all let me know what y'all think. All right, so that's it. As always, it's your Lulu. Be bold, be brave, be fearless, be free.